Hello and welcome to the Coffee Mac tutorials. We've changed things up a lot. Um, basically what we did, we hit refresh like Satya did as well. Um, what we're going to do is go into the concepts of Business Central. We're going to explain it in detail how it works and we're going to try it in a very simple way. So what you need to get going with this is a login into Business Central you need to go in there and go into the company Kronos that comes in as a demo company. You should have easy access to it. And from there, you will actually have everything that we are going to show you. So you can follow our videos with Kronos. Um, so what are we going to talk about today? We're actually going to talk about item or items. So what is an item really? Um, one good way to explain an item, coffee cup. Coffee cup though is a very simple, good item to work with. You can count coffee cups, uh, it's solid, you know, it's, it's a very nice item. What would be an example of a difficult item? Water. Water is much hotter. A bottle of water, easy. But if you pour a little bit into the coffee cup, what do you have now? How do we track that? We're not gonna go into that in this video, we're going to start out with a more of a coffee cup scenario and make it easy, but we will move towards the water. So I hope you enjoy it. Stay tuned and look at the video. And now we get to the system. Uh, I am logged into Business Central on the cloud, as you can see here. And I am logged in as Paul at enactouniversity.com. And uh, I am logged into the company Kronos USA, which is a test company uh, that you find in Business Central. So if you just installed Business Central, you can probably log into Kronos USA and get the same thing that I'm looking at here. So what I'm going to do is create an item. So I just go here into items and I get a list of all items. Uh, and I hit new. And I'm going to create an item with no sales tax. And it brings me up to a screen that is uh, filled out partially and is asking me to put in this description. I'm going to put in here uh, I like the coffee mug and close it out. And now I've created an item. So this is the simplest way to create an item in Business Central. You really don't need any other information except the description and what type of item it is, like item without sales tax. I would like to add a picture to this to make it a little bit more interesting because as you can see here, everything has pictures. So I click on it again, go into picture, import, and hit a picture to choose. Find my image, open, and here the picture comes. Close it again, and now I have a picture. So right now we have added an item in Business Central, and uh, it really only took two steps. Just hit new, type in the description, and close. Adding a picture, of course, it's a little bit of a vanity, but uh, I think with such a pretty user interface, uh, the items definitely should have pictures. I hope, I hope you got something out of this. Until next time.